Okay. A candidate for Toronto City Council has sparked a big debate by suggesting drivers pay a congestion fee if they drive downtown, but they don't live or work in the area. Elvira, what do you think? Good idea? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait a second, we just shook hands and we've been hanging. <laughs> Okay, uh, be what? well, I, you tell us why. Come at me. Why do you, Come at me. Why do you like the idea? Well, because it's a gridlock. The downtown is a nightmare. Yes. I've lived downtown my entire life. I live in the East End, so I would not be part of the affected area. But the, you know what? Now just turn your outlook to your own neighborhood. Just walk your own streets. You don't need to go to where all the congestion is. It's such a nightmare to just sit and not move anywhere. And this is like a, this is a municipality's dream, a quick cash grab. What's the alternative? Everything else that you might consider to limit traffic, because you need to. I mean, let's face it, there are just too many people and not enough room for everybody. That's so why do I have to pay for bad urban planning? That's not my fault. Well, no, it's not, but then what's the alternative? Is like, do you want to restrict it to, like, just so everyone with just blue hair go on Monday, and then that, you, know, you still get a whole... I have an idea. You get a whole range of people, and then you can have, like, gender non-conforming Tuesdays. I don't know. Like, I love that. It seems to be a lot of work. This is easy. This I think is easy. if there was a great alternative called great public transit, then I'd be like, I understand. But I don't have another, a lot of people don't no. have another don't choice. We're not friends. So my, <laughs> radical, my radical idea is when you ask, why is it so congested in the city? Now, I'm not going to poo-poo that people need a place to live. But there's a condo going up on every single corner. Mm -hmm. Call that 2,000 units. Call it 3,000 units, 4,000 units. So that's thousands of people you are bringing to one city block. There has to be a fund where, for so many thousand units, you need to give me 10 more streetcars so that I can actually get from my house at my condo to work. to some sort of oversight, right? Like, and then, you know, by what you're saying with all of these condos going up, it's always, you know, tends to be like the next generation has somewhere to move, so we shove them into these condos downtown, and with them comes these new ways of getting around. I'm talking about the weird e-scooters, you know, like they're, they're <laughs> zipping on, it's not a bike, but it's in the bike lane, but it's not a car. That's and then, a whole other segment. And it is, <laughs> then we're talking about those demon unicycles. Those, if there was ever anything to elevate the world of, of mime life, do you know what I mean? Like that weird <laughs> yes, the unicycle, the unicycle, but now, yes. but now, it's got, is, now it comes with a helmet. This and is a, a no for me, because then if oh. I have to pay a fee, then you're not going to see me on the social. Yeah. Okay? okay? Like, why? People, here we are talking about inflation. Here we are talking about um, um, unaffordable um, housing costs. Now we want to add a fee to come into the city yeah, yeah, yeah. that's ultimately going to benefit the city because we're here, because we're spending money? No. You know what? You know what? Guess what? This will promote what we have been... Are you been... trying to rebuild our friendship? I am. I really am. <laughs> this will promote what we have been promised since childhood, individual jetpacks. Yeah. You know what I mean? we just fill... jet we just, yes, we just fill the air with ourselves, and then we just, you know, drop down to the <laughs> store that we want to shop. My insurance is going to go up. <laughs> I'm just saying, there's other options, and I don't mind this. Stay, you know, stay in your own neighborhood. Discover what's amazing about that. Dad. Please be my friend. Oh. Hey there. Wasn't that great? Do you know where you can find some equally good content? Our YouTube page. It's filled with discussions, debates, and some laughs. Head there now. Like and subscribe.